The Rutgers women's tennis team dominated doubles today and had a win in their singles match by senior Miriam Zane. Well, they played uh, fourth, a, a great effort. Uh, College of Charleston is a really good team. Uh, they're well coached and they fought hard, and so credit has to be given to them. But we let it all hang out. I told the girls at the end of the match, they gave their best effort. We just came up short, just on a couple of points, and that was the difference uh, in this very tight, well-played college match with a score 4-3. Uh, the College of Charleston, they fought hard, and at the very end, when it was crunch time and it was, uh, uh, and the match was on the line, they played very consistent tennis, and. Uh, just a little bit more consistent than we did and that was the difference. It was really good. Um, I think we had a lot of really good energy from the beginning and um, we didn't never let up. Um, I know against a lot of opponents that's the hardest thing is to kind of keep the same energy throughout so I think that was um, obviously one of the main things that helped us uh, win today. She was tough. Um, I think she um, you know missed a few balls here and there but for the most part she um, was a really good opponent she hit the ball really flat and so that was kind of a new thing um, for me so I had to adjust my game for that she uh, hit it with a lot of spin and kind of kicked back um, so I had to do some adjusting but um, by the second and third set I was pretty well adjusted to it and you know could play my game so I think I was able to take advantage of um, just a fresh start in the second set and um, just keep my confidence up and really just play aggressive throughout the second and third set. The Rutgers women's tennis team won all of their doubles matches today despite losing their singles matches to College of Charleston. The girls will be playing their next match Wednesday, March 9. Reporting from the East Brunswick Racquet Club, I'm Jacqueline Louie.